Introducing T-Mobile KVD21 5G Home Internet Gateway. In the box, Gateway. Power Adapter. Quick Start Guide. T-Mobile Terms and Conditions. Safety and Regulatory Notice. The Gateway offers 4G LTE or 5G NR when mobile network connectivity by way of four wideband omni antennas that supports all LTE 5G bands. It functions as the connection point between the WAN outside your home and the LAN inside your home. Specifications Physical Interfaces Setting, use the mobile app, using the Quick Start Guide and the T-Mobile Internet mobile app provides the easiest setup experience. The T-Mobile Internet mobile app can be downloaded from either Google Play or the App Store. Manual Setup, you will start by identifying the ideal location for your gateway, that location will meet the following criteria. Near a window where the signal strength is strongest. In an open space away from. Walls or obstructions. Heavy duty appliances or electronics such as microwave ovens and baby monitors. Metal fixtures, enclosures, cabinets, reinforced concrete, or pipes. Near a power outlet. On an upper floor of the home or at least 6 feet off the floor. Connecting power to the T-Mobile 5G gateway. Place the gateway on a flat surface, such as a tabletop or similar, close to a window and near an electrical outlet. Minimize the number of obstructions as much as possible. Connect the gateway's USB Type-C power cable to its power port, then plug the other end of the power cable into a grounded electrical outlet. The USB Type-C power cable must be capable of supporting 100 to 240 volts, volts, AC adapter, 50 to 60 Hz frequency and 3A of current at DC 15 volts. Starting the T-Mobile 5G gateway, after the gateway is connected to a power source, the LCD screen displays an animated T-Mobile logo that indicates the gateway is starting up. Four small dots displayed on the LCD panel indicates available screens. Take a moment to browse these screens to see what information is available. The startup sequence is complete when the LCD shows. Connection. Devices. Messages. Language. Connecting devices. Connecting Wi-Fi devices. Connect your wireless devices to your network using the Wi-Fi SSID, Wi-Fi name, and Wi-Fi key, Wi-Fi password, which are found on the gateway's rear panel. Here is an example of the label. Connecting Ethernet devices. The gateway has two, two, Ethernet LAN ports. Use an Ethernet cable to connect devices that don't have Wi-Fi adapters or capabilities. Home screen, the home screen contains five sections, Internet connection status, connection quality of cellular signal strength, gateway information, Wi-Fi network settings, and the QR code of T-Mobile Internet mobile app. Connection status, shows network status of the connected devices, the gateway, and the cellular network connection. Connection quality, cellular signal strength is represented by number of bars. Gateway information. Firmware version, variable. UI version, variable. Running time, how long it has been since the gateway's last reset slash power cycle. Serial number, variable. Wi-Fi network settings, gives you a way to manage and configure wireless settings on the 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz networks. T-Mobile Internet mobile app, scanning the QR code with your smartphone for the easiest setup experience. Wi-Fi network screen. Accessing the Wi-Fi networks from the web GUI's main menu gives you a way to manage and configure wireless settings on your Wi-Fi networks. First you must log in using admin credentials, password. Click on Where is my password? On the screen to show your default administrator password located on the gateway label. Clicking Manage Wi-Fi networks from the Wi-Fi networks menu gives you a way to manage and configure Wi-Fi settings on your networks. The Wi-Fi network screen contains the following options, combined slash automatic, recommended, Provides the best Wi-Fi connection to the connected devices with automatic selection of the radio frequency, 2.4 GHz or 5 GHz. Separate networks, you also can configure the following SSID specific settings for different types of Wi-Fi devices. To create a new Wi-Fi network, the 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz options become available by selecting separate networks. Configure the following Wi-Fi settings for the new network. Click Save Changes to save the settings. Click OK to finish the Wi-Fi network configuration and the home screen will be displayed. Replacing the SIM card, the gateway comes with a pre-installed SIM card. You can replace the SIM card by pressing the card into the card slot. Before replacing the SIM card, please read the following safety information. Hazardous electrical voltages and currents can cause serious physical harm or death. 
always use insulated tools and follow proper safety precautions when connecting or disconnecting power circuits. Ensure the gateway's power supply is unplugged from the power strip or wall outlet before proceeding. Access the SIM card from the backside of the gateway. Power off the gateway by removing the power cable from the gateway and from the electrical outlet. Remove any Ethernet cables connected to the gateway's LAN ports, LAN 1 and LAN 2. Use the finger pull to open the SIM door. The SIM card socket supports push-in and push-out installation. With the SIM door open, press the pre-installed SIM card into the slot and the SIM card pops out. Carefully remove the pre-installed SIM card. Insert and press the new SIM card into the slot. Be sure the SIM card clicks into place to ensure that it is properly installed. Close the cover of the SIM card slot and ensure the cover is securely closed on the SIM door. Using the reset port, press and hold a paperclip in the reset port for 5 seconds. Withdraw the paperclip. LCD shows, factory reset in progress. T-Mobile animated logo. Power up animation. On the LCD, press OK on the LCD panel and you will see the connection screen. Precautions, do not insert any sharp object into the openings of the product. Do not put the product near a heat source. Do not place the product on an unstable surface or support. Do not place anything on top of the product. Do not open or try to open the product. For more updates subscribe to our channel.